Is this a parade, the one o'clock parade? appreciate my novelty horn you're not going to turn around and chase me are you? I should slow down to capture the smiling faces oh, there are a lot of them isn't there lazy sandy afternoon got no time to worry Take my time and drift away Some people may say my life is in a rat city de -de -de. Happy with you Ha 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 Two straw fumes Oh I've not missed the uh, riding parade then Bloody hell where are all these going to park? There'll be chock a block on the main street then, won't you? That'll be good. I'll uh, I'll bring my camera and maybe do a bit more filming. Oh yeah, it's a proper mod bike. Got Laurel and Hardy on the bike. A sticker on me, not the chap. Hello. And visual them. Yeah, she's being filmed now a bit. Hello, hello. So she weren't waving at me, I don't think. Oh, there are all the bikes here. I'm not turning around to follow them because uh, it's going to be chocker up there as well. Hello, hello. Yeah, you're on camera. Hello. You're on camera, hold it. Smile. Give me the wave. Can I'm spider, yeah. 
Hello. Smile, you're on candy camera. Smile, you're the star of the show. <laughs> Huh. I wasn't going to say it on the way home, I'm glad I've met the parade. One o'clock, is it one o'clock? Yeah, five past one. Well, if there's a gap down the middle, I'll jump down the middle. You got left behind, Albert. <coughs> Keep up, man. Solid white line up here, isn't it? A scooter track. Yeah, stuck in traffic. Oh well. I'll uh, title this Scooter Parade Entering Clitheroe. And you can all see if you can spot yourselves on my camera picture. I was going a bit too fast initially <laughs> that miserable tracker that didn't smile is now stuck in traffic <laughs> Ooh, double white lines is it really that against the law? I mean if it's not dangerous it's actually a guide for my front wheel in fact, technically, I'm not going over. My wheel is now in between them, so there. There's the A59 chucker. Might be better going through Wally. Yeah, I could go home on that little scenic back road. Where are you going, Albert? Oh, and you live there. I think they'll stop, won't you? That mini's gonna stop. There we go. Wouldn't it be nice to get on with me neighbours? Land a few potholes, thank you. Better than stopping in on a Saturday, innit? I was going to clean my bike today and not really bother going anywhere this weekend. Sort of interesting. Like I said, I'll have, uh, they're so expensive though, I'll have a Vespa for winter commuting and just about fitting my yard if I remove the step on my stone stairs I built last year. <coughs> Put a waterproof sheet over it and use it as a work commuter it's like I said they're nice and compact they're not the type of scooters that are really seven foot long 300cc in a nice compact style with plenty of oomph I think they'll do 90 mile an hour easily so I could go on the motorway warm and dry knees that'd be nice wouldn't it for winter instead of soaking wet and cold knees more faffing about with bloody roadworks. See that new estate? Mm. Yes, we're doing the drains. We built the houses, now we're connecting the drains to the main drain. So even though nobody's working on a Saturday, we're still going to inconvenience everyone by putting these lights here. Unless there's a big hole to fall down. Well, well, look at that. Well, yeah, a hole there, I suppose. Mm. Oh, there is someone. Yeah, I'm just messing about with the barriers, mate. Yeah, I'm going to sweep up, fill them holes in, and then uh, sort your jobs are good. Un. Oh, do these executive homes or shops? 
That's a new estate there, the people in already. Yep. They're quite nice, aren't they? I mean, they're not identical boxes. You know, certain estates look quite nice these days. Whenever it's mentioned on television, they pronounce this as Wally. It's not Wally, it's Wally. Despite the uh, spelling with an H, you think it would be pronounced Wally with an H. But it's not. It's silly. It's Wally. I mean, in Manchester, there's a Wally. They, they call that Wally Range. It's, is that not? We have a Wally Range in Blackburn. It's Wally. It's Lucy Meacock, you can't spell. Spell, can't pronounce stuff I mean. But I forgive her because of that lovely little bottom on her cascading blonde hair. Wouldn't it be nice to get on with my neighbour? Ever since I was a young boy, played the silver ball. So hold down to Brighton, I must have played them all. Ain't seen nothing like him in any amusement hall. That deaf, dumb, and blind kid sure plays a mean pinball. Do 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 do. Ain't got no distractions, can't hear no buzzing bells. Do 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 do. Plays by sense of smell. Deaf, dumb and blind kids So please you mean pinball Do 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 The pinball wizard has to be a twist The pinball wizard got such a... Yeah, indicate, yeah, we don't know where you're going then Albert, do we? Them little orange lights aren't for Christmas Yeah, traditional ironmonger's shop. Not so many around here. Go on, Albert, what are you waiting for? Yes, yes, pay attention. Ain't got no distractions, can't hear no buzzing bells. Wally Wine Shop, and you sit in there and get rat assed. Look at that old pub, 1781, and it's now a bloody co op. Scandalous. I used to know a lad that I used to work with, Ultra Frame, and he became a landlord there, but it was very quiet. Like I said, get a theme going on and get something happening. Yeah, so what I suggested uh, before, oh we can't afford to have a band on but what you do, you go to a local college, put the word around that you've got a band room fully equipped and tell them, say you want somewhere to play a few tunes and as long as you can knock a decent tune out, a student band will play for peanuts so get them on what are you paying us? Uh, five free pints each and I'll give you a tenner each end at night if it's been busy Right, you're on. And even if they're just sort of amateur players, they'll still, still bang a tune out, won't they? So there I got a student band on. There then, negotiate this bloody hairpin now. There must be a way of straightening it out. Yeah, uh, paint, uh, paint your wood, it's called for some reason. <coughs> paint your wood. Pinball wizard has to be a twist. Pinball wizard got such a supple wrist. Yeah, 
the last of the umps. <coughs> no. A nice lawn. And the hell is that cat weasel? The telling bone, the bone that speaks. Nice but bumpy this road. I'm gonna go too wild. It's a TT road. Children, he no buzzing bell. Have no sense of direction, played by sense of smell. Do, 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 do. Ain't seen nothing like him in any amusement hall. Deaf, dumb, and blind kid. Sure plays a mean pinball. Bum, 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 bum. Diddly, diddly, diddly. Pinball wizard, there has to be a twist. Pinball wizard got such a supple red. This would have been a better route for the scooters, but it might have struggled with that hairpin bend at the bottom. Yes, this little village is called York. One pub, Lloyd Nelson. Bed and breakfast. <laughs> And it's really nasty. Not a pothole, it's just a dip in the tarmac at the bottom of this hill here. Penny, I actually think they'll level it out. Always get a shock up my forks. And I go down it. Not my tires annoying off, I don't need that anymore. Yes, if ever you, any of you mods will know what I'm on about, I've got a novelty horn with eight sounds. You might have been able to hear them when I were going past your little cruise in, but this microphone doesn't really pick them up because it's stuffed in the form of the chin guide. But I have sent for a twin microphone from China. Must be a good one, it's coming all the way from China and it's less than four quid. <laughs> including post and the idea of that is have one picking my voice up and the other under the seat picking the engine noise up you're going to stop for me out of it thank you very much maybe they're filling that dip in patching it up without bleeding time Yeah, was the Beatles uh, music any any other songs could be called a mod song? Paperback writer, paperback writer, paperback writer. <laughs> Dear sir, or madam, will you read my book? It took me years to write. Will you take a look? Based on a novel by a man named Leon And I need a job and I want to be a paperback writer Paperback writer <laughs> Or the B-side rain When the rain comes you run and hide their head They might as well be dead When the rain comes 
When the rain comes, when the sun shines, you slip into the shade, you sip the lemonade. When the rain comes, when the rain comes, rain. I don't mind. Do, 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 the rain comes. So there was a question I asked on my first video. What would you call a classic mod anthem? Please leave your answers below and I'll leave a link. I'll search for the tune on YouTube, find the best quality version. And then leave a link so you can click on it and have a listen. Is it a strict thing, like the jam small faces and the who? Or is there a bit of Tamla and Soul mixed in as well? Do you like good music? Yeah, yeah. Sweet soul music? Yeah, yeah. Spot Lad and James Brown now? Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. If you like good music, yeah, yeah, sweet soul music, yeah, yeah. Twisting child now, yeah, yeah. Whenever I want you around, yeah. What about Smokey Robinson and the Miracles? I like them as well, fantastic. What about a little bit of Zeppelin? There's a lady who's sure All that glitters is gold And she's buying the stairway to heaven Ooh, She's buying the stairway to heaven do 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 She's buying the stairway to heaven. There's a lady who shows all that glitters is gold. She's buying the stairway to heaven. Anyway, so, this is, like I said, the second part, bringing to the conclusion my little date. I'm stopping for me a little bit. That's where people in a, in a quandary at roundabouts have had a scenario of being stuck at a roundabout and nobody's moving. Well, I, I give way to the right, well, so do I. Well, so do I. Well, nobody's going to bloody move then. So one person should move, like I just did. Yeah, any pussies to clear the road. Midweek, there's a half past two one, but uh, I'll see, and if there isn't any, I'll uh, phone a taxi. That little woman used to work at my paper shop. And ever since she didn't, the bloody shop doesn't open now early in the morning. She used to be there at five o'clock. She never knew the price of anything. How much is that rice pudding look? I said, I don't know. I said, I think it's 10p. <laughs> Right, that's all for now. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.